black. Okay. I'm gonna try and see if I can figure out the lighting and stuff beforehand. Because I kind of want the light to be coming from the crystal that she's holding. Yeah, I'm trying something a little different today. I guess this is similar to the process I did back with um, the near piece where I do black and white kind of colors first to get what it looks like. The shadows. And then I'll figure out how the color works from there. It's not really ambient... ...occult... <laughs> How about we do this, this, and then we add the gradient map. Yeah. Let's try a few different gradient maps. Oops, not that. Uh, maybe this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. This one works pretty well, I guess. And I can also change or add in a little bit of color. Inna used the gradient map layer in Clip Studio Paint to bring the shadows to life. Let's reconstruct Inna's drawing step by step. Inna fills the outline of Iris with a gray background layer. On the shadow layer, she used a soft airbrush and various brushes to draw shadows dominated by black levels. After finishing the shadow, Inna lowered the opacity of the gray background. Then Inna started using gradient map layer. Let's take the grayscale gradient from black to white as an example. Gradient map can replace the color of the gradient according to the shade of the color. The gradient map layer can apply the effect to all layers in the same folder. What the soft airbrush works is actually the difference in opacity of a single color. Gradient map will have no effect. That's why Inna added a gray background under the shadow layer. So all the shadows become grayscale colors. Gradient map will have effect. Finally, Inna lowered the opacity of the gray background to match it with the original color. We focus on Iris again. Inna lowered the opacity of the gray background. She used gradient map and fine-tunes the colors. Finally, Inna customized various colors in the gradient to achieve the atmosphere she wanted to present. Conclusion Gradient map is a very convenient tool. We can apply it to shadows to quickly adjust various atmosphere.